Good morning. Good morning, everyone. I mean, right now it's morning for me, so I guess uh, I would say good morning. <laughs> um, yeah, before starting, I just wanted to say uh, thank you for anyone who's uh, watching. I know I don't have a lot of subscribers at the moment, so uh, the few of you who are watching, um, thank you for watching, and uh, I hope you, you subscribe to my, ch my channel, because, um, yeah, <laughs> you're going to be seeing a lot of, lot of videos from me. I'm doing this for one year, one video per day, as a reminder. Uh, today, uh, I'm doing another rare movie review. A rare movie review. So, you know, actually, I, I wanted to do this because last... Uh, I'm going to do a reminder about last week. Last week... No, not last week. Yeah, last week. Last week, I watched uh, King of Comedy with Stephen Chow. And uh, after doing the review, I mean... I actually watched the movie after that and I thought, oh wow, I actually liked the movie a lot more than I remembered, you know. And, uh, you know, it reminded me, you know, I mean, that's there's a reason why I picked those movies, you know, it's because, you know, they kind of like touched me um, inside, you know. So I feel like, oh wow, you know, I, yeah, I really love uh, some scenes in that movie. And there's not that many scenes, you know, most of the scenes in that movie are a little bit uh, kind of offbeat. But there's a few, quite a few that just like, wow, you just makes you remember the movie. I think that's important, you know, in a movie that you have at least a few things that, you know, make it very memorable. So, you know, you could watch like a recent movie, uh, like a Hollywood movie where you, throughout the whole movie, is is pretty good, a lot of good scene, good mix and balance. But then uh, there's no, uh, <laughs> there's nothing, one scene that you actually remember. Uh, but uh, when there's a movie that I love, it's because there's actually a few things that I remember, no matter how inconsistent the whole movie is. I will give you some some example, you know, a Star Wars movie, The Last Jedi. Uh, I mean, everybody is like uh, telling like, oh man, this movie is so crap because of that canto bite scene. Like, oh, there's some scenes like weird and everything. But actually, even though like it's a little bit uh, uneven throughout the whole movie, there's quite a few scenes, you know, maybe one or two that I just remember because I thought I was on the edge of my seat as when I watched them. So, you know, if you really love movie and if in particularly if you make movies, try to remember to have like those few like just unique scenes that make you uh, you know, just uh, remember fondly about a movie, you know, like this there's, there's got to be like some a few like emotional moments. Anyway, so uh, I'm going to uh, do this uh, yeah, I wanted to talk about this because I feel like my last review about King of Comedy, it didn't really do it justice, you know. I just remembered, oh, I really like that movie and I talk about it. But then as I watched it, I was like, oh, you know, I really like this movie. <laughs> but today is not about King of Comedy, but it is still about Stephen Chow. That's right, we're sticking with Stephen Chow or, um, <laughs> or a star of the moment, I would say. Uh, because we're going to uh, look at another movie from him, and actually a more probably, probably more popular movie and more funny movie, even though there's like a lot of cringe-worthy scenes, and also um, I, I remember there's a vegetarian friend who watched this movie and really, really hated it. I mean, it's all about food, okay? So don't, you know, if you're sensitive about that, uh, just, uh, you know, just just a fair warning. Uh, God of Cookery. God of Cookery is a wonderful movie. Oh my gosh, I think that's the moment when I started, you know, to really love Stephen Chow. Actually, maybe it was before. There was another movie before, a little bit, kind of a crappy movie that I'm not sure I'm going to make a review on it. But this one really, like, make me, oh my gosh, Stephen Chow is a comedic genius. That's why we got, uh... We got Stephen Chow, and he, there's like a little bit of character development, you know. Even in the beginning, Stephen Chow, he's a real asshole. He's a real jerk to his employee. He's treating them badly, and he's like uh, so uh, cocky, full of himself. And then uh, he has a breakdown, and then later he comes back as, uh, <laughs> you know, being god of cookery or whatever. Uh, and it is, it's a lot of comedic, and oh my gosh, I don't even know if... I mean, it's, yeah, it's all about food, but you know, the... the all the the jokes and comedy in that it's throughout the whole movie it's kind of uh, related to some other storyline and it's like so so funny this movie is so funny that's how I remember it um, 
I'm going to watch the trailer right now and uh, let's see um, what I can remember from it. Uh, let me connect my little headphones. I, mean, I don't really need that, but you know, it just makes it cool that when I wear the headphones and watch the trailer. Let's see.为之心，牺牲又何憾？少林寺方丈，法号梦维。少林寺十八铜人。啊啊再加九毫九毫九毫九就可以換到呢個黑骨頂心嘅骨頭鏈嘴。呢、這個鏈嘴因為經我食神開光，所以對於青年男女談戀愛有妙不可言嘅功效嘅。加埋印度神又仲如虎添翼添啊！實在太銷魂，實在太好啦！有啲咁嘅事咩？唔係啩？咩都有可能嘅，聖誕節啦嘛～<笑>就是说 ，the trailer does not， 呃、uh, ，does not give， 呃、um, ，does not best represent how the movie is。I mean， this movie is over the top， laugh out loud funny， and、uh, full of like crazy stuff、um,。嗯 ，I like that，、um, that little、uh, sound， da da da， is uh is like that throughout the whole movie。I know， because it's very， uh， yeah， there's a lot of mystery around it。Oh, the the monk there, yeah. You know, there's the image of the monk. He's funny too. Oh, all the characters are funny in there. You know, there's like, uh, it's just a weird movie, but it's like a really, uh, okay. It has subtitles, okay. So find a version that has subtitles. But there's there's a, you can probably find. You know, I mean, the trailer doesn't have subtitles, but yeah. What else can I say? Um. Uh, the yeah, the movie is about food. Uh, it's about uh, yeah. Oh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> no, really, you should check out this movie.、Um, yeah, so Stephen Chow,、uh, you know, a very、uh, cocky uh, uh, chef uh, who、uh, who gets uh, uh, loses all the grace of the public, and then he's、uh, he needs to find a new way to come back into the limelight.、Uh, there's a、uh, Karen Mok in there. Karen Mok is an actress who also played in King of Comedy, probably later. She looks very ugly in this movie, and it's actually on purpose. But、uh, you know, I sh- I don't know. Like she, 
She's a uh, usually a very pretty actress, but in this movie, uh, she, she was made to look a little bit ugly. Um, and um, yeah, you, know, you can see her, and she's trying to kiss Stephen Chow. <laughs> well, it was very cringeworthy. Oh, she's actually cute in this movie. I don't know why to say. Um, a little bit sensey moment in this movie. I don't know. I'm just gonna spoil it, you know. But uh, they, at some point, she, she's supposed to die, but she doesn't really die. I, I'm just spoiling it because you know when I watch this movie, you know, I, I really feel bad when she died, and actually, you know, it's like. I mean, it kind of <laughs> ruined the rest of the movie for me. But at the end, it was like, oh, okay, whatever. Uh, no, really, you know, Stephen Chow, um, king of comedy, and uh, now. Um, God of Cookery, you gotta watch the, uh, his movies. I don't know why Stephen Chow is getting a, a little bit of uh, uh, backlash uh, about, uh, you know, I think uh, in real life he's a little bit of an asshole. <laughs> but, you know, I still consider him as my favorite uh, actor director because I haven't figured out anybody else who can. Uh, <laughs> that I can think of as. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of good directors and actors that I like, but. Stephen Chow, uh, still my my top uh, at the top spot. All right, I hope you have enjoyed this, um, and uh, you know I, th I think we're gonna roll with Stephen Chow again next next time. Uh, I'm gonna find another movie because you know when I talk about uh, my favorite actor director, I, I I gotta you know spend some time on it, right? Thank you, and um, I hope you enjoyed this video. See you next time. Ciao.